hello guys uh, welcome back to my channel once again today I will just show you how we can uh, use this best Pi and then the flash into this uh, Kali Linux for those of you who like the Linux uh, who want to do the pen testing and all that with the use of the Linux and inside this uh, Raspberry Pi 4 which is of uh, HB it's not much uh, further do let's uh, kick in so uh, here you see that uh, there is a 32 micro SD card which is uh, already here so today we will be using the micro SD card and then we will be flashing the Kali Linux uh, into this uh, Raspberry Pi 4 so uh, this one we have to flash it uh, with the Kali Linux so we will insert this one into our system and then uh, we will use the Raspberry Pi uh, image software and then we will uh, flash the Kali Linux into this uh, memory card and after that we can use this as a pen tester tools or the systems so let's uh, start so we will put this one into the system and then the So I plug into the system and then the, now in the system it is detected that so we can go to our system and you can see that so my uh, uh, memory card is detected so now I can open our Raspberry Pi image yes so we will fire up and right now it is not yet selected so for those of you who want this uh, particular link we will uh, give in the, the description below so uh, first of all you have to download the software from the Raspberry Pi Imager from the Google Store and then you can uh, just install it to your system after that uh, you can come to where I am so let's uh, select our image so there will be so many options but I'm coming to do use this custom settings so we will go there and we will select this uh, Kali Linux image and we will open that and then we will select our storage so that is USB this one micro SD that is uh, of 32 GB and then we will do some settings here so host name enable application all this we can also put that uh, if you want you this SSH you can put if you don't want it so username for now I'll just put this uh, my uh, okay and uh, for password I'll just put so now okay so land settings if you want it you can connect and there are also some settings which is also here extra settings so if you want we can set it if not it's okay so local setting and all that you can do it's okay US layout keyboard it's fine so now we can just save it that and now we can start writing to the micro SD card so it will take some time and it will ask and uh, give you warning that this card is going to be completely wipe out everything that is inside the card so make sure that you don't have any important data difference so if you guarantee it you can just click yes and then the raspberry pi will start writing the image flashing the image into the micro sd card and this will take some time difference so we will fast forward this video and then once it finish we will be back so till then you can just uh, grab your coffee and have it and then just uh, you know enjoy the moment and by the time we finish so we will be tuning back once again and by the way thank you so much for all your support every time and for your subscription and always helping us you know which help us uh, to do more videos so i'm sure all of you also will be excited uh, to do more 
as I am so uh, if some of you are interested also you can also uh, purchase these things and you can try out it's always good to try the new things and then yeah keep us ourselves updated and learn more and do more so we'll be back with that Kali Linux is one of the best preference most of the other were equipped with me so now the verification is all almost uh, done and uh, after this we can just uh, remove the micro SD card and then we can just put into this system so uh, then we can just uh, give the power out here 5 volt power and then it can support two uh, monitor 4k monitors and the audio and here you have uh, two USB 2.0 and then 2 3.0 then here Ethernet the LED card it is given there and the cooling system of the cellular body is by this two fan supporting fan so let's finalize it and then now plus it is done and now your SD card is ready and we can just continue and then we can close this and now close that now our card is ready so we can just uh, remove from the system and then we can just fire up and see so okay so now the card is here so now we can just uh, put into this uh, SD card slot now this is our power supply so here I will give the power here and then this micro SD card will go to the monitor okay and then we will put our uh, keyboard and mouse attach here this is for the keyboard and that we should also the mouse so one for mouse one for keyboard all right so now it is already As you can see now, our price ready and so we are good to go. Let us see how it's here. Let's start this here. Let's sit down with us. Right now, we are running with that. 